Turn me up a little bit. Okay, folks. Oh boy. All right, we got something special. To, special announcement tonight. Uh, let me turn that monitor down a little bit. I wonder if this is going to be backwards or forward sometimes. My oh yeah, it looks like my image is reversed. That's okay because I got my I got my phone number reversed in case I needed it. Turn my monitor down a little bit. Um, okay, folks, let's talk about uh, Christian Taliban of America. Um, we'll be meeting uh, at my house on Saturday night. I'm going to Saturday nights at seven. Um, this is in, um, in Bucks County, Pennsylvania. I'll give you my phone number. You call me first, and. Um, and leave a message. I like that. It looks nice and um, nice and low budget, like the Taliban. It's funny because I, I restarted the computer and uh, the font is backwards now. But um, I, I wrote the phone number both in both directions. Just so, so call me there, leave a message, and I'll, I'll tell you if we have room for you in my house. Um, we're gonna meet. Be nice to meet in person, you know, with real people. Uh, I mean, I meet Sundays with, with my friends at um, of the house church, but uh, it'd be nice, kind of nice Saturday night um, uh, Christian Taliban. Uh, you don't have to be a Christian to join. Um, you know, you could be uh, anybody who's really you know has an interest in. Uh, let's put it this way: it's people who don't want to who don't want to just stand around and watch while they're. You know their their children and their wives and their loved ones are you know raped and murdered by government-sponsored thugs like you know the the um, Bolshevik you know <laughs> like because we that's where we're heading it looks like we're heading for a Bolshevik type of uh, event and um, and so this is for people who don't want to. <clears throat> Just stand around and do nothing. You know, let's talk. For, for now, you know, it's a think tank, basically. And by the way, Taliban, all that means is student. So you're a student of Christ. You're a student of um, the truth. And uh, you want to get together with like-minded people. Um, let me flash my phone number again before the end of this little conversation here. Uh, there's some things, um, for instance, we could push for that, you know, you we see like... The, the Taliban, um, and this is the interesting thing. Hold on, let me turn that down in the background. Um, okay, so the the Taliban over there in, in the Islamic one in Afghanistan, they had um, uh, what would you call it? They had stopped the world's most powerful military. You know, they, they had stopped the the you know the powers of the West. Um, you know, that, that, I like what they're doing in Michigan. They're you know open carry with the machine guns. Um, that's one of the things we can do. Like in Pennsylvania, for instance, uh, you know the motorcycle, the bikers got them to allow them to ride without a helmet if they wanted to. Um, I think that would be kind of is a good idea. Maybe if we um, got. Um, Pennsylvania, um, the idea of, you know, carrying machine guns around is a good idea. I think that would be a great way to, um, you know, install a little fear in the government, you know, because um, they're going to be less likely to, like, do what they're doing in Australia, where they rounded up people's children. I think it was, like, 24,000 children they took away from the parents to vaccinate them and they took them to a stadium or something to vaccinate them. Um, if everybody's got a, a machine gun strapped over their shoulder, you know, this kind of thing is going to be less likely. Uh, These are the kind of things I want to talk about with the, you know, the Christian uh, Taliban meeting that we're going to have. Um, I want to hold them every Saturday night. It'd be kind of nice to have every Saturday night. You know, if you're over 21, we'll have drinks, of course. 
Um, and we'll sit around and, you know, do some brainstorming, like, you know, how are we going to, you know, what should we do, what, what you know, how are we going to navigate this material, um, you know, what, what are some of the things that, that you know, we can do uh, uh, you know, that's going to discourage the government from, you know, going full tilt tyrant. Um, and I like that, you know, look, if the Taliban has succeeded in, in s stopping the world's most powerful military, you know, <laughs> then, then we should be able to do that too, right? You know. And so that's sort of the way I'm thinking this. But it'd be kind of neat to, you know, have some people to brainstorm with, you know, and, and sit around and chit chat. You know, what are we going to do? You know, that's, you know, we could talk bullets, we could talk guns. Uh, we could talk guns, and more guns, more bullets, uh, strategies, you know, um, um, ambushing, um, if they're going to be, a, you know, like a vaccine patrol or a gun confiscation patrol, you know, we could talk about, you know, setting up ambushes and so forth. You know, just typical common sense, basic, you know, basic no-brainers, you know. Um, so I think that'd be kind of fun. Let me uh, let me just continue to um, uh, screen my uh, uh, broadcast my my, my phone number. Um, you, know, you live in Bucks County, uh, Mercer County, uh, Newtown, Yardley, Northeast Philadelphia, Philadelphia, um, Trenton, Hunterdon County. I went over Saturday night at 7. Give me a call first, though. Call me first, this number. It's a Christian Taliban. And uh, let's get this thing going. It'll be, you know, this is just the first chapter. Um, eventually, these things will be all over America. And, um, yeah. <laughs> so, anyways, thanks. I thought I'd, you know, it's been a while since I posted anything. And um, I wanted to touch base. I'm still, you know, I'm still reading books. I'm going to do some more book reviews. And. I'll do some more New York Times trashing and so forth. So, all right, thanks for hanging out, and uh, you know, make sure you give me that phone call and leave a message. We'll talk to you. Take care. Bye.